Hi there, my name is Nicola and welcome to my channel where we learn stuff about WordPress, HTML and CSS and Bootstrap. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how you can code with Brackets Code Editor. This is a completely free tool and I'm doing this because in a few days I'm going to start a video series about creating complete website with HTML and CSS from zero. I'm going to use brackets with few extensions and they will make coding easier for you. Before we start, if you want to support me, don't forget to subscribe and for more fun, smash the bell notification. Let's go! Here on this screen is brackets code editor. You can download it on the, I think, just type the brackets that I O on Google. When you open it, here on this side, you can uh, click on Extension Manager icon. Here you have the available extensions, and here you type the what you want. I already installed the Emmet, the three icons, color highlighter, HTML skeleton, and indentator. This one is theme for brackets. Okay. Emmet will be first, just in available, here type Emmet or any other extension and you can find it and install it, okay? Emmet is very helpful tool because, for example, I already created this index.html file and if you need a boiler template, just type the exclamation mark and press tab and this is your boiler template but html skeleton do this job much better but i will show you in a second but if you going to code for example you need a division with name of container just target with punctuation mark you can target class type the class and press tab and you will get your division with specific class. Also, uh, if you I now need a navigation, you need UL, and this UL will contain the LI, and each LI has, for example, link with class of VTN. Let's add some parentheses, and you need, I don't know, four links, press tab and you will get your four links. Also, you can do this on this way, for example, four links, just like here, or you need ul with li, and here type link, add class, for example, just like this, and if you want to copy the whole line, press Ctrl D and you will get your line in multiple times. Uh, next extension is HTML skeleton. Let me delete all of this. Click here. Of course, you can install it in Extension Manager. Click here on this icon, and this you can choose which element you need. In most cases, I need a full HTML skeleton. Click done, and this is your boiler template. Just fill the title, add a few more links if you need a bootstrap or font awesome, and you are ready to go. Okay, next link, next extension is indentator, for example. If your code is a messy one, just like this, what you can do, indentator is hidden to your code, just click Control Alt I and your code, code will be indented. Okay, the next extension is HTML highlighter 
or I think color highlighter. Let me see. Click on extension manager and click on installed. Installed ones. Yes, this is the color highlighter. Uh, here, for example, let's go on styles, style.css. Let's put some color. And let's type, I don't know, 458, this green shadow. And this hex code has the background color with own value, the green one, okay? Also, if you click on this value here and press Ctrl E, you can get this option when you where, where you can change the colors and change the transparency to RGBA. Okay. And the last one, the last extension is three icons. Default brackets is just without these icons, for example. And with HTML file has this HTML like five icon here or three because this is the CSS tree. And let's add the JS file. Let's save it. Main.js. And this is icon for JavaScript. I hope that you get this one because three icons. Extension add little icons here besides name of your page. Okay, guys, this is all for today's tutorial. Next one will be first episode of our HTML and CSS series. And there I will show you how you can create a complete website from zero with just HTML and CSS. Also, our site will be mobile responsive. Before the end, if you like my work and if you want to support me and my channel, don't forget to subscribe and for more upcoming videos, smash the bell notification. Thank you for watching and see you next time. Bye bye.